Did you hear that sound of bugling elk back there? Well, it's about that time of the year I get super excited about going outdoors and listening to the sound of nature, especially the elks. I'm in a national park going after elks today to capture three different scenes in a single day. First of all, I'm gonna try to photograph the bugling elk. Second is the elks in fight. Third is the family portrait. I know it's gonna be a challenge in a single day, but let's see how it goes, yeah? been sitting down here for a couple of hours now and I've been watching that herd of uh, elks down there they've been doing the things the elks would do chasing each other fighting and mating so I thought I would talk about the fight while I'm waiting here uh, what spurs them to fight why did they fight uh, the answer is really simple they fight for the dominance the bull elks uh, create something called harem, which essentially means the big herd of uh, female elks and including the bull elk. The bull elk becomes really aggressive to the other elks and very protective of its, its, his own harm. So he makes sure, he creates the territory around the harem and makes sure that Nobody from his herd uh, gets out of the territory. Uh, if, for example, one of the cows run off uh, and gets out of the territory, he would run chasing after her and bring her back. And uh, if a younger elk comes into territory looking for an opportunity to uh, mate with females, and the same story, he would just chase him, chase him down until he completely disappears. When the bull elk comes in, another big bull elk comes into the territory, that's when the fight begins. That really means a challenge. And the old dominant male must halt his ground and fight back really hard to hold on to the power. So that's how it works with the elk world. There he is, the largest bull in the area, watching over his arm. And there is another smaller group of elks, with younger bulls nearby. Meanwhile, there comes an ambitious male into the territory. A bachelor bull, looking for a chance to take over the harm. And he began provoking a younger bull into a fight. Challenge accepted.
it's over. Well fought and he's taken over the younger bull's harem. It's time to round up his cows now. But there is one more round to finish the job. And he moves on to challenge his next rival, the dominant bull. The dominant bull's tactic seems not to get into a fight. He is trying to intimidate him. The bachelor walks away for now. Now that there is no other bull standing against him, he continues to dominate his kingdom for another day.